morning, students. Happy last week of fourth grade. I can't believe it's our last week together. So as you know, at the end of anything that you accomplish, it's really important to do a reflection. That helps you feel really proud of yourself and it helps you learn from all the things that you have done. So when you finish a year of school, it's important to do reflection. When you finish reading a book, it's important to do a reflection. If you graduate, when you graduate, it's important to stop and reflect on it. So this week we're gonna be doing little reflections and today I wanna show you your first reflection. So watch me as I do your Monday, Monday reflection. So students, you'll see a document that looks like this that's attached to your Google Classroom today. It looks a little scrunched, right? But don't worry about that because I'm going to show you how to make it bigger and how to make it look really cool when you present it. So this is what you'll be typing into today, Monday reflection, reflecting on this school year. So the first thing you can do to really read it is press present. See that? When you press the present button, it makes it so you can read it. Now you can't enter in this way, but it's just a little bit easier to read. Reflecting on this year. Directions. Think about this school year and fill out the graphic organizer below. Now remember, graphic organizer, graphic meaning like a picture, an organizer, a way to organize. So this is a, a picture way to organize your thoughts. These are the pictures. This is how you'll organize your typing, your thoughts. So the first thing I want you to reflect on is something that you're proud of that you did this year. What are you proud of? And then you're gonna type it here. Then something I will continue to work on for next school year. What's something that you have been working hard on but you want to get even better at it? The most important thing you learned this year. Who's the most important thing? What's one thing you learned about yourself this year? What's an, a goal you achieved this year? And what's a goal you have for next year? Now to get out of the present, you just press escape. Okay, and now this is how you can type in it. Now you didn't have to press present to make it big. That's just a little trick that I do to make it a little easier to read. So now you're gonna go ahead and type something I am proud of that I did this year. So you're gonna delete answer here and type in something that I am proud of that I accomplished this year was my region project. This is something I made with my mom. We spent a lot of time on it and we had a lot of fun together. And then you'll click down to the next one. Something I'll continue to work on. So again, you delete your answer, or you delete this text. Something that I want to continue to work on next year is my multiplication facts. I worked hard on our quizzes, but I know I can do better next year. So students, this is what you'll be doing today for your reflection. And again, I'm going to assign you a, a different type of reflection every day. And I can't wait to see what you're proud of. Remember, it's really important to take time and be proud of yourselves and know that I am so proud of you.